We all know Americans use billions of coffee cups each year at Starbucks and McDonald's alone. Well, now those chains are launching an experiment to reuse coffee cups. The next gen cup challenge could dramatically change our coffee drinking routines. Look for Nick Monticelli shows us how it works and finds out if Metro Detroiters are up to the challenge. So here's the thing, it is second nature to finish your drink, have the garbage and just toss it away. But instead, the thought process is to not throw this cup away and instead drop it off at a collection site, have it sanitized and then reused. This is a uh, mocha and that's a regular veranda plant. We stood on a corner in Campus Marshes for just a few minutes and instantly saw dozens of people carrying a throwaway cup. So yes, we know this is a problem. And people like Larry Alexander like the idea of reusable cups. I know it uh, is probably a good idea from a uh, refuse standpoint. But to be you reusing the same cup, that's something you do at home after you put it in the dishwasher. And Larry is not alone. I'm fine with a reusable cup. I'm not sure about one with a chip in it that's tracking. That sounds kind of scary. Today, Starbucks and McDonald's launched a pilot program in California using smart cups equipped with RFID chips or QR codes for tracking. When customers are done with the cup, they'll drop them off at collection points where they'll be picked up, sent for cleaning, and then used again. On the streets, a healthy mix of opinions. Well, I would definitely reuse them. I go to McDonald's and Starbucks way more than I should for coffee. Well, it might work in certain parts of the country, but I think overall people want to have a fresh cup. I think it's a great idea, you know. I mean, it's in a world we're trying to be environmentally friendly. The only real question is how clean is clean and how do we know? Sure, I'd be thinking about it, um, but you know, I got to think they'd address that. They'd have to put up some type of protocol and definitely make sure everything goes accordingly, but I think definitely they could work something towards it. I think it's definitely could be uh, beneficial, you know, get rid of a lot of space taken up and the cleanliness thing, you know, people probably going to try to point that out, but it's no different than going to, going to Dixon Lafayette, Coney Island and getting some of a cup that they just washed. So. In downtown Detroit, Nick Monticelli, Local 4. Nick also tells us the idea of those trackers on the cups is to track where cups are and see which communities are most or least willing to reuse the cups. Still ahead.